Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back. So we are back at Snow Runner. It's been a year since I've played this game, so I thought why not give it another shot. I really enjoyed playing, uh, you know, and uh, I was really curious to see all the updates. So anyways, last uh, uh, mission that we did was Wet Harvest. So this time we are going for a pipe dream. Uh, in this mission, we have to deliver to factory a heavy fuel tanker and then two bricks and one metal beam. So for this mission, I'm going to use three trucks. One is this one and one is a GMC and one is another truck, which is like all wheel drives. I don't know, eight wheeler or something. I don't know what it's called. So anyways, uh, for this first, I'm going to go and get our uh, fuel trailer and deliver that to the factory. After that, I'm going to do the bricks and then I'm going to do the metal beam because metal beams is the longest uh, 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 distance that we need to travel because the truck cannot cannot go through muddy area or where there's a lot of water. So I have to take a very long path for it. So I wanted to do that in the last. So let's see how are we going to get our semi trailer first of all so we have to go all the way here and from here we gonna take this path i guess and all the way to the factory so let's mark our path and start the mission so first here then here here so pick up our trailer from here and then we'll mark the rest as we go so let's start our truck here we go So the reason why I chose this truck is because I really like it and I have uh, all wheel drive upgrade for this truck and it's pretty easy to drive to be honest so I thought I should take this truck. And I have not opened uh, you know unlocked uh, off road uh, tires in the game yet. So this is the best choice I have for now. So anyways guys if you really uh, if you like what I'm doing please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe it really helps a lot <laughs> we are already stuck come on so all wheel drive system is on but still, I don't have off-road uh, tires. These are highway tires, so it's really, really hard to get through mud in this game with these tires. So I have to be careful that are going through these rocks. They can really damage the suspension. Oh man, these are really big ones over here. Oh, look at that one, huge. Oh, 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 oh. Man, this is very slow. So here we are at the fuel station, there is our tanker, so we will get that and just let, that, let us refuel fast and now we will tag along this tanker and move it to the factory. Okay, there it is. So let's see how are we supposed to get to the factory I guess we'll follow this path over here to the bridge to this part which is going to be super tough I'm sure here it is and we will keep on continuing through this path this is this is going to be tough one going through the muddy area with a huge tanker behind us and no off-road tires so yeah there it is let's see how it goes i hope it goes well let's go
turn off the all-wheel drive on the road because it can really damage the differentials all-wheel on and that tanker is huge but this is a really good truck I tell you that it can pull anything you know All wheel on again. Ah, oh, a rock. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh shit. Oh. <laughs> You have to be careful. <laughs> you have to be careful, slow and steady, man. This thing is crazy. More mud. It's getting dark. That is a huge, huge trailer. Oh, big rock. Those were some big rocks. You have to be very careful about these rocks, you know. They can really damage your, your truck. have to go on low gear differential lock just to go ahead because it's kind of a climb and it's muddy and it's really tough oh man it's full of rocks have to be careful Let's go.
So we have some momentum now. I guess this is the last stretch. We are almost there. Have to be careful with those rocks. So here we are, finally, safe and sound. Okay. What? I guess that's it. Uh, so <laughs> I was a little bit confused, I think. Uh, we need to drop it somewhere. I guess I'll just leave it here. And move on to the next object. Objective. I'm gonna park this truck over here. So I'm gonna move on to the next one, which is over here. I'll go to the um, global map, and then move to garage. I'm gonna use this truck to carry uh, what do you call the bricks. So to get to the bricks, we have to go to the warehouse first. So I'm gonna take this path all the way from here to here to here to here. So this truck is really good. It has uh, all-wheel drive and differential lock constantly. You can't turn it off. But that because of that, uh, it has a really bad turning radius. It, it takes a huge uh, radius to turn it around. So, anyways. so goddamn dark so this is a really muddy area so i'm gonna take a detour which is a through here because this tire truck also uh does not have off-road tires so it's gonna be really hard to go through with highway tires through the mud it, they are extremely horrible for that so i have to take a detour over here hopefully we can cross it yep So we have to go up from here. I wonder if there are people really doing this kind of job, you know, dri driving in an area with this kind of, um, you know, uncomfortability. I, I mean, I, I really don't want to do this job, driving a truck through this kind of terrain and you know as a job never this is such a hard job and full of patience to be honest and if anybody does this huge respect to them and it must be fun but man this is very dangerous and tough job to do
So here we are at the warehouse. From here we're gonna pick up our bricks. How many? Two bricks. So now we have to deliver them to the factory. So we have to mark our way. So I'm definitely not gonna go through this area because again there's a huge puddle over here and and it looks pretty open. And because of that, I'm sure that most of the land is very, very muddy and very soft. So even if we take a detour, uh, detour through this area, it it might have a very soft land, and my truck's just gonna dig deep into the soil. So I think so. I'm gonna take a different tool, uh, route, which is coming out to here, and maybe going this way, and going up from here to here, and then just following this road all the way uh, to the to the factory you know it's the same route that we took with the oil tanker so let's go ahead uh, let me see whether they have metal beams also over here concrete service oh they have metal beams so I guess the uh, we might take that trailer. I'm not sure whether it's a good idea, but we can give it a try. Let's see. Let's see if it is a good idea. I'm seriously very nervous doing this. I don't think it's a good idea, to be honest. I think the trucks are uh, uh, it's really closely attached. I just want to go a little bit forward. Okay, th I guess that's the distance, normal distance, so. Okay, so one metal beam, not even enough space. Yeah, there it is. Okay. So the thing is, I was going to use three trucks initially, so I already had parked a truck over there. Oh, where is it? Over here. As you can see, there is my one truck that I was going to carry metal beams from here all the way to the factory. But as we discovered that we already have an extra trailer over here. So I thought, let's get going with this thing. I'm not sure whether we can drive uh, so much load through uh, such a difficult terrain. As you can see, the, ra the turning radius is worse. Because the trailer is almost attached to the truck. Uh, but this, this looks tough. Just let me check. Okay, so... The thing is, this area might be very tricky to go by, but let's see if we can make it. If it's not, we, I'm just going to drop the trailer over there with the metal beams and move without them. As you can see, the turning radius is horrible. Ah, oh, man. One damage. The turning radius is horrible. I guess I'm just gonna go through the grass. I don't think this truck is good enough. Look at that. It's horrible. But let's see. I hope we could make it. I hope. I am just need to take really long routes. Turns and... <laughs> Man, this truck does not want to turn. Go into low gear. Go 
there, I think there's too much load on the truck. And it's so dark, I can't see how much uh, uh, the tires are getting dug into the ground. This is tough. Oh man, that is a very narrow path. I'm not sure if we can make it through that. Let's see. Okay, that's good, that's good. That is very good. This truck is really good. I just need off-road tires for it and man, this truck will be the best. Okay, so the climb is here. Put it on low gear because I don't want the tires to slip. Man, this truck is really good. Okay, so there's the soft mud i hope uh, we can get through it i think we will be able to, nothing's gonna stop us Turn, turn, please turn, turn. Okay, finally. I guess we are through. Through. We are through. Through the most difficult part of the track. Oh, oh, oh my god, see the rocks, <laughs> so much damage. I have to be slow, I was going too fast. Just to see, yep, we are going the right way.
Okay, so this is a tough area. It's a climb, so we we were very slow during transportation of the fuel tanker as well. But this truck is way more capable than that one. I mean, look, it has eight wheels, all-wheel drive, differential locked. So nothing can stop this one, at least. Okay, so this is a dangerous part. Too many rocks. We have to take a right from here. It's already day. <laughs> it's already day, man. So here we are guys almost finishing our mission it was a good journey but not so tough uh, hope I have actually parked the oil tanker right in the way oh, man <laughs> what have I done okay turn back turn back Turn back, turn back. I'm gonna just, uh, you know, change the truck and what do you call? Move that out of the way. less too far away so let's move this big boy out of the way oops I guess I'm gonna take it all the way for now I'm just gonna move it here Just for now, I'm just gonna move it here. Stop the engine, change the truck. I c Man, this is not fair. I can't change the truck all the way from here. Mm -hmm. This is just stupid. Now I have to take this trailer all the way back. I guess that's good enough. Stop the engine, change the truck, take this truck first over there, get everything off of it and then move this truck out of the way. So here it is guys, we did our uh, pipe dream mission, it was not a very tough one, it was just a little bit strategic, you had to be uh, strategic with what trucks you need to use, it was a gamble taking this trailer with this truck, you know, because of the turning radius of this truck is really bad, And but I, we still managed to do it and it was a fun drive and 
I really had a lot of fun doing this and I will keep on doing this more and more and making more videos about it. And if you did enjoy it, please don't forget to like, subscribe and comment. I will surely reply to all the comments that you have. And please support the channel, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.